Hi hey, YouTube. So uh no I haven't made a video in a little while, but uh today I got my 16 inch Troy Industries upper receiver with uh 13 inch TRX Extreme Battle Rail. So when we get into it. So uh I ordered it last week, it came in actually it came in yesterday. very nice everything that you see on the rifle right now uh, comes with it it was about uh, 1225 and I got it direct from Troy Industries online catalog it comes with uh, you know bolt charging handle comes with the front and rear flip up sights it also comes with Troy Industries own uh, hand grip and it has an extension piece actually. Here's the extension piece. I just took it off. You have the uh, Troy Industries uh, Medieval Flash Suppressor. Very, very nice. Has a serrated end here for, you know, just, I guess, breaking in windows. Not that I'd be doing a lot of that. I do that enough in the military. So, um, it's a nice. A uh, very lightweight system. I think uh, eventually I, I'm going to definitely change out the bolt. Probably to a Spikes Tactical uh, chrome line bolt. Uh, if you guys have any uh, suggestions, let me know. The charging handle, I'm probably definitely going to switch to a uh, ambidextrous, the Chori Industries charging handle. Other than that, um, you know, I also got uh, what I'll be adding to it is uh, the Surefire it's a M93 flashlight it says IR capability for you folks who don't know what IR capability is it means infrared so when you're looking through night vision you can actually see the light flashing but the enemy won't be able to very nice thing I picked up um, retail it's about almost $650 I got this for free so other than that let me touch up on uh, what else comes with the rifle it comes with three of these uh, handrails uh, quick attach uh, rails it comes with two two inch uh, pieces and it comes with one leaf four and a half inch uh, it's easy to install. I actually uh, bought the 5 inch. You folks can see that's what I have on the bottom here. The 5 inch rail. It's easy to install. You have the back plate, you know, to put in. It really depends on where you're actually placing these uh, handrails because it can be uh, tricky. You want to make sure that you don't. Uh, especially with the longer ones, the screws extend out and sometimes it'll uh, interfere with the gas block if you're trying to put the rail back onto the weapon. Other than that, it's a, it's a great, uh, great upper receiver I picked up. I can't wait to get my lower receiver. I will be getting a Spikes Tactical lower. Um, it's full kitted out. Uh, it's their CTR stock. It's the Punisher lower. So uh, I guess we'll see uh, when that comes in. I'll make a video probably on the lower receiver. And then uh, make a video on the complete build. Alright YouTube, thank you. Thanks for watching. God bless.